So, um, but to get into more specifics, um, you know, we, you know, it, in terms of Amazon, uh, obviously, you know, we've gone through different iterations of how we organize the business. Um, you know, when we were a smaller company, we pretty much just had an Amazon expert um, and, and PPC, right? For us, PPC was always a specific skill set from day one. It was always clear. Um, you know, we had writers and we would, you know, we would freelance, you know, we would outsource that here and there, especially in the beginning when we were really lean and mean. Um, not that we're not, you know, uh, lean now and try to be efficient, which I'll get to later. Um, but, you know, we had someone that was just responsible for, for, you know, everything on Amazon and then PPC. Um, as we, we started to grow, we started to understand what it was the, that there are just so many different skill sets, um, and levels of expertise in different areas of Amazon. Um, you can say that about any business, any marketing business or any kind of, um, you know, business, um, but, you know, Amazon is so specific and you may not know that until you start to get into it. And I'm sure a lot of your listeners know this, but like the way you have to deal with this specific platform and why we, you know, created a business was, what, you know, you needed to approach it in such a specific way um, that the more that we were able to diversify the roles and find things, you know, that were great in very specific things, the better um, we were able to accomplish our goals and build like lasting partnerships with our clients. So, um, you know. Again, one we had an account manager that that was that was the name of the position, and one of the big changes we made over the last few years um, is we separated it out that that position into two roles. Um, one of them was a brand manager, which is focused on growth strategy, essentially being the expert, um, and a project manager, someone who is focused on making sure that things get done right, making sure that um, you know you're coordinating with the, with all the different team members. Um, the brand manager being one of those team members, you know, one of the tools in, in the, in their, um, arsenal, um, and just being able to separate that out, letting, letting the brand managers focusing on working with the clients, um, you know, keeping up to date with being Amazon experts, um, finding strategies and making sure that they're analyzing the data and, and doing everything that's necessary to grow in such a competitive market, really, um, let us get to the next level. Um, we also, just to kind of give you a, a high level overview of all of our departments and how we work. So we have the brand manager, the project manager, um, and, and, and the functions that they serve. We also have a dedicated logistics department, which focus, uh, focuses on inventory management. Um, you know, back when we were smaller, um, the brand, the account manager, um, did a lot of the logistics and, you know, you may be able to find someone that has that skill set, but it is a very specific and very complex thing to be able to, especially at an agency where you're, you're dealing with all sorts of business, everything from the supply chain, um, to just getting things just in time for Amazon. And I'm sure some of your listeners know about the, the latest changes that are happening in, on inventory at Amazon. Um, so you have a logistics department, um, you have customer service, someone that just deals with the customers, uh, making sure you're responding as quickly as possible within 24 hours. Um, you have, uh, advertising, of course. Um, that's just a specific skill set. Really important that they keep up to date with all of the, of the latest things that are happening on that platform and communicate with the brand manager and even logistics um, to make sure that, you know, if you're running out of stock, you got to pull back on ads. Um, so um, and we also um, have the um, graphics department. So it, those that are doing graphic design um, videos, you know, anything kind of visual content and the written content. Um, and then beyond, behind all that, we also have a, a, um, a team of administrative assistants and specialists with, uh, data specialists that are doing a lot of the work, a lot of the account management aspects, a lot of the, uh, reporting, you know, data upload flat files, um, and, you know, uh, case management and, you know, obviously I can keep going on, but, um, that's like kind of the, the main structure of the business. And obviously there's things on our uh, other side of the thing, like marketing and, uh, fine, you know, uh, uh, bookkeeping and all that stuff. But in terms of operations, you know, that that's the the main outline. 